Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're talking about Christian Leroy Duncan versus Gregory Robocop Rodriguez. CLD 10 and 1, 4 and 1 in his last five fights. The loss that he has is Armin Petrosian. Just was trying to do too many funky things. I thought he could have done very well in that fight and he just looked really, really bad. Uh, basically a pick 29 years old, 6'2". 6'2". With a 79-inch reach, fighting Rodriguez, who's 15 and 5, 4 and 1 in his last five fights. He has a loss against Bruno Fiera, which I think was the effect of the Chidi and Jaquani knee. If you have watched that fight and then you watched the Bruno Fiera fight, it was four months apart. Uh, 32 years old, 6'3 with a 75-inch reach, one inch in height, four-inch reach advantage for Duncan. I really like Rodriguez in this fight. The problem is, is if Rodriguez stays that distance with CLD, then CLD is going to do very well. It doesn't seem, though, when Duncan is at distance, you would think because of his style that at distance, he that's where he would want it. He always seems to, to be a little bit more comfortable in these fights when he's a little at closer range, like clinch range. That's where he finished. Uh, uh, both guys have finished Dennis Tululian. Both on a two-fight win streak against Dennis Tululian and Brad Tavares. And Dennis Tululian and Claudio Roberio, which again, both guys, not great. Brad Tavares is the best opponent out of either one. Rodriguez has fought and lost to the best guys. Better guys than CLD has even come, come close to fighting, honestly. You know, he's, like I said, 3-1 and one in the UFC. And a knee injury against Desco shouldn't count as a win. Sorry. Sorry, should be a no contest. I mean, he got freaking hurt. Not from anything uh, CLD did either. But yeah, Rodriguez, I, I think, is the more well-rounded guy. He has to close the distance. He can't eat punches like he did against Brad Tavares. Had him on wobbly legs there for a little bit. But I like Rodriguez to get the job done. Um, again, I just think he's a little bit better. I think he's more well-rounded, has more power for sure. But if he can get CLD to the ground, it's going to be huge problems. But he has to close that distance. And he has to in intelligently. He can't just try to pressure him. CLD's very, very good at countering those actions. But again, I like CLD. He, I, mean, I like CLD. I like Gregory Rodriguez. He has 12, no, 13 finishes out of his 15 wins. And he also has uh, seven first round finishes. Has been finished three times by punches. But I don't think... Only once in the UFC, but I don't think CLD is the guy that's going to do that. And as always, guys, subscribe, like, comment, and let me know who you're picking. Peace.